What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Blu ray Tay back again with another video. And I just wanted to show you guys real quick how to go ahead and update your iOS devices uh, via the software over the air update. And um, the devices that are compatible, as far as iOS, um, excuse me, as far as the iPhone, are um, it's dating all the way back to the iPhone 4S up to the present iPhone 6 and 6 Plus. And um, for the iPad, it's all the way back, dating all the way back to the iPad 2, all the way up to the iPad Air and the iPad, what is it, Mini 3, I guess. Um, so let's get into it. So you first want to just go into, make, you first want to make sure you're connected to the Wi-Fi. So you want to go into your settings and um, go into your settings. It looks something like this. Make sure you scroll down to general software update and there you'll see iOS 9 it's only one gigabyte if you do it over the air which is uh I know Apple has been trying to reduce the size of the over the air update so that's pretty good so you don't have to delete too much stuff off of your phone if you have like a 16 gig or just limited space and um, as compared to the uh, iTunes update it's uh, one point 84 um, gigabyte so this is you know almost a whole gig smaller so as long as you're connected to Wi-Fi you can go ahead and uh, download it and install it and I'm gonna do that here um, put my pen in okay and terms and conditions go ahead and agree And once again, make sure you back up your phone to uh, iCloud or back it up to your computer before you perform the update. You never know what may happen. And I know I've, I've read earlier today there were some uh, errors when people were attempting to go ahead and update their um, iDevices to iOS 9 via over the air update. So it looks like it's fixed. Uh, it says I got about a minute remaining, so let's go ahead and wait and see. Alright, we're back, and the update is finally finished. It took probably like 15 minutes or something like that for it to actually be complete, but you just got it, just prompts you to put in your password, and then you'll get this updated, update completed. So go ahead and hit continue. Go ahead and enable location services. And let me just throw my password in. Okay. I was going to go ahead and update the iCloud settings. Diagnostics, don't send. Come on. Okay, welcome to iPhone get started and it looks pretty much the same as it did before but I can see um, that the news app was added and also they added find friends again I don't want that but a quick swipe to the left you can see the little uh, new area that they're given to search and series suggestions and things like that a little copy from HTC's blink feed but I'll go ahead and do another video about the different um, updates and changes for iOS 9 and um, I can go over everything in a little bit more detail so thanks for watching please comment like share and subscribe peace